This is my sonar setup. You can see the oscilloscope there, and there's the sonar. I'm standing about two meters back, and wearing soft clothing, so I won't reflect the uh, sonar signals or sonar stealth. And I'm going to use a DVD case as my target. You can see there, I'm just getting it at the right angle now. If the DVD is not facing the sonar square on, it doesn't get a good return signal. But when it's facing directly at it, you get a nice strong signal from, that's about two metres away, although it's hard to show in the video. You can see the echo there. It comes and goes if I, as I change the angle. <clears throat> as I come closer, you can see the echo moves closer to that initial burst. The burst on the le is on the left side of the screen, and that's uh, the sound going outwards. The echo follows it, and you can see it moves in and out there as my distance changes. Um, and you'll see it getting stronger and weaker as I get the change in angle of the DVD case. There you see the output of the comparator. I've tried to filter out the 40 kilohertz uh, signal. So what you see now is just the overall shape of the burst at the start and then the echoes. There's some noise that I have to get rid of and I need to get those peaks higher so that the uh, processor can read the different uh, the distance between that first uh, burst and the first echo. So they need to be nice, strong, clear signals without any noise.